welcome back and uh, what we're going to learn in this video is how do you write a statement in the form of a linear equation in two variables okay now what may happen is many a times you might be given certain practical situations okay and uh, you might be asked to write them in the form of a mathematical statement the reason for writing them in a mathematical statement arises because that helps you to solve a practical problem okay while we're not going to solve a practical problem in this video that is something we do in the subsequent videos the idea behind this video is at least let you know how you can write a given statement in the mathematical form of a linear equation in two variables the cost of two pants is equal to the cost of three shirts okay so let's say you have pants okay now you are told that the cost of these two pants is equal to the cost of three shirts pardon me for the kind of uh, what should I say the picture that is being drawn but we, we are trying to understand how do you kind of write it in an equation so you are told that the cost of the two pants is equal to the cost of three shirts but hey wait for a minute what is the cost of a pant I don't know pants basically refers to trousers okay so let me call the cost of one pant or one trousers is equal to P okay you may call it P you may call it X whatever suits you okay since we've been using X and Y I'll use X over here okay let the cost of one pan be equal to X then what are you told that the cost of two pan if the cost of one pant is X what is the cost of two pants simple it's two times X or 2x right and this is equal to the cost of three shirts but again what's the cost of the shirt I don't know so let me assume it as a variable y so let me call this as cost of one shirt is equal to y okay then what is the cost of three shirt the cost of three shirt like cost of two pants is equal to three times the cost of one shirt or three y but we are told that the cost of two pants is equal to the cost of three shirts or in other words 2x is equal to 3y right what's the standard form of an equation it's ax plus by plus c is equal to 0 if I just take this to the other side I get 2x minus 3y is equal to zero there's no c over here but I've got the variable with x coefficient of x I've got coefficient of y and I've expressed this in the form of a linear equation in two variables the art of writing this lies on the fact how good you understand the given equation okay the better you understand the facts the more are the chances that you will be able to write this equation properly and this forms the basis because if you go wrong in terms of writing your equation then be rest assured that you cannot solve the problem perfectly leave alone perfectly you can't even solve it correctly in all the situations that you will come across normally in addition to this statement there will be some further information which will be given to you okay which will help you to find out the value of X and Y but these are something which we see in the advanced stages of this chapter for now just enjoy writing a linear equation I'm sure your practical books have a lot of question around writing linear equations try to visualize the situation something like this okay try to write it simply and see what you get thank you for being with us today for those of you who are eagerly watching for our next video that is going to be around what do you mean by solution of a linear equation in two variable okay and how do you find out those solutions so keep watching our channel for more videos around this